What's up my fellow gig workers? Welcome to the channel. And if this is your first time here and you want to watch more video of different kind of gig apps like Uber Eats, DoorDash, Skip the Dishes, Instacart, which I haven't done for a while, not my favorite, like, subscribe, hit that bell so whenever I post a video, you will be notified. So today I would like to share with you guys this experience with Skip the Dishes. I'm going to show you guys a short clip. So I received this order from Skip the Dishes. And it says 1.8 kilometers for $10.37. And uh, look what happened here when I click. When I click the location where the restaurant is. 19 minutes, 12 kilometers. Misleading information. So you can notice from the video, my location to the restaurant is, was like 12 kilometers. Not 1.8. This is the third time this happened to me. If you guys experienced this, leave a comment down below. What do you guys think? Is the mileage measured from the restaurant to the customer or from when you accept the order, your location? When you get pinged at that location to the restaurant to the customer. So I opened a chat with Skip the Dishes rep and this is what they said. So here I said in the chat room, order says 1.8 but it's 15 kilometers. And then he replied, hi, thank you for reaching out to the skip the dishes. The distance between the restaurant to the customer is not far and you are accurately paid for it. I am 15 kilometers from the restaurant. Why misleading information? I have a screenshot. He reply says, for your reference, the distance is always calculated from the restaurant to the customer, not from where you are. Do you want to complete the order? I said, really? Okay. Call head office to find out. I mean, I'll call head office to find out. He said, sure, please. So what I did, I did a little investigating myself, tried to track the kilometers from my location to the restaurant, to the customer, and then track the mileage from the restaurant to the customer. I'm gonna show you guys those clips. So this one is $7, 4.5 kilometers. Okay, I'll accept that one. So we're gonna track the kilometers. A is going to be from the time I received the order, pick it up from the restaurant and drop it off at the customer. And B is going to be from the restaurant to the customer. So let's navigate to the restaurant. Here it says 6 minutes 2.3 kilometers from my location when I accept the order to the restaurant. So from the location when I accept the order, to the restaurant took me 1.6 kilometers let's zero B because we want to set it zero from the restaurant to the customer so collect order let's click on customer six minutes 2.7 kilometers a is the wrong trip 4.4 kilometers that's from when I accept it to the restaurant to the customer and B is 2.8 kilometers so you can see from my little investigated the distance is not calculated from the restaurant to the customer it's calculated from when you receive the order you get ping and from that location to the restaurant to the customer that's your total mileage and that should show on the app the correct mileage if it's off by a one kilometer that's okay but you're off by 12 kilometers right let's look at DoorDash here I took a screenshot of one of DoorDash order you can see from that blue dot that's me and then the restaurant to the customer this order was 20 kilometers for $12 do you think that restaurant to that customer is 20 kilometers? No. If there's a glitch in the app, why do you skip the dishes reps are saying the distance is calculated from the restaurant to the customer? Is that misleading information? Or he or she is not know what they're talking about? Or they think we are stupid? We have no idea. I've been doing this for four years. Never measure from the restaurant to the customer. Uber Eats, DoorDash, 
Never. From the first time you received the order, there where it's calculated. To the restaurant, to the customer, period. That distance from the restaurant to the customer was really close. I'm sure it's 1.8 kilometers, but I was far away. The rep wasn't helpful at all, zero help. He could have reassigned this order to a different driver who were close by to the restaurant instead of me to drive 15 minutes to the restaurant. By the time I got there, the food was sitting there for 15 minutes waiting, it was cold. Customer get the food late. Zero help from the rep. This is the first time I heard this. The distance is calculated from the restaurant to the customer. If this happened to you guys, leave a comment down below. Let me know. I want to thank you guys for watching. You know what to do. Hit that subscribe button down below to support the channel. Stay healthy. Stay wealthy. Peace out.